What's up, guys? It looked like vaping decoded. Yeah, new name. Uh, WTVC is going to be switching over, so it'll now be called vaping decoded. I'm here at the Vape Shack with my friends, and I wanted to get a video in really quick, really quick review. Uh, review is going to be on. What shall it be on? God, stupid autofocus suck. Take two. Nope, I don't ever take two. You're cracking. V2. My vicious aunt. Um, <clears throat> this is what I got. It comes in a little box. And I forgot the box at home. But this is the Kraken V2. And the Kraken V2 also comes with, uh, you can either use the rebuild heads or the rebuild deck from the Kanger sub tank. Uh, it's 304 stainless. It's um, some special rose gold glass. And there's the phone again. And um, the cool thing about it is it's top fill. Because all you got to do is twist this off. Boop. Top comes off. And you can fill it from the top. You don't have to worry about taking it off your device to fill it or anything like that. And it screws on nice and tight. I haven't had any problems with it wobbling off. How's it vape? Vape's really good. Really good flavor. It's got uh, good air control. Um, oddly familiar. Oddly, oddly, oddly familiar. Um, I'm used to the OG Krakens, man. I'm used to the Kraken being a Jenny. So I look at this, you know, pull it out of the box. I really like it. It's really nice. It's really pretty. Looks good on top of my Pandora. But what does it look like? What does it perform like? What does it remind me of? Reminds me of the Kanger sub tank. Um, I think, and the, I took it home. I got it yesterday. Uh, they're nine or eighty nine ninety nine here over at the Vape Shack. Um, we got a lot of them in. So if you guys want one, call us. We can ship them out to you. I do have to charge for shipping this time. It'll be five twenty five for shipping. Sorry about that. Uh, we got twenty of them, eighteen of them, or something like that. If you guys want one, <clears throat> I took it home and uh, vaped on it. First thing I thought of is. You know, it reminds me of my sub tank. So I grab my sub tank, put it on my Vapor Shark, put it the same wattage, same juice, sorry, liquid, same head, everything, and I vaped them side by side all night last night. The only thing, other than the top fill, which is awesome, um, the only thing that I see different from the Kanger sub tank is that the airflow is a little bit tighter. It's a tad bit tighter, and I think that the way the air is entering into the atomizer, Gives you a little bit better, uh, better flavor, better vapor production. A little bit, little, little itty itty bit, itty bit. Um. So here's my thoughts. This is this is what I'm thinking. I'm thinking that there are some pages out there that were getting really really upset because you had these you know people that were that own high end devices, Geppettos and Waparis and you know Hurricanes and Top Hats. I have no clue. I have no clue what happened. I think I bumped the, either bumped the power cord on my laptop or whatever, but it cut everything off. Anyway, what I was saying is uh, the Kraken reminds me a heck of a lot of the Kanger. I think uh, the reason, one of the reasons why the Kraken came out was because people got sick and tired of seeing what Paris and Geppettos with uh, Kanger sub tanks on them. So they brought the Kraken out to, uh, so it's a higher end device on a higher end device. But I like it. I really do like it. I like the airflow. I think it's uh, set properly. Um, it's supposed to be an all whopper jaw, like the um, kind of like the, the Kanger sub tank is. It's more precise. I think that's why you're getting better flavor. Um, it is nice. It's uh, for 90 bucks. Would I buy one? Yeah, I'd buy one. Um, do I think that it works a thousand times better than the sub tank? No, I think it's a little bit better. I do like the top fill feature. So there's my supplement. There's my video. Hope everybody liked it. Um, if you have any comments, please put them down below. Hopefully some of that information will be helpful to you guys. And uh, we'll see you.